Well, here come the two kids. Speed demons. Just keep going straight. Yes, keep going. We're coming. hard to pedal up that hill. We could get an ice cream. Huh? Yeah. Do you want to keep going or what do you want to do? I was going to go down the hill. Oh, well, I was going to go around the corner. What's on that corner? No, that's the corner down the hill. Whoo, you guys did good. That's hard to that get up the hill. Huh? That one will eat you. That one. You have some lunch? No. Where's that one will eat you? I don't know. Let's find out. Yeah, we'll show you. We've been there. We're not going that much farther. We can go down to that outlook again if you want. Go to the big opening. I'm going to that opening. We could. It's not that far. It's right there. You just got to take a right. Which hand do you write with? Uh, yep, that's your right. Quiet up here. That's probably a little too loud. We didn't film that the other day though, did we? Mm, no. I don't think we did. So no. We're gonna walk down there and get that if you don't mind. I'll Go ahead. Stay here with the bike. Well, then. I'll stay here. Huh? I'll stay here with well, the bike. I need the GoPro then. Yeah. going so going just a minute I'm gonna go film this down here and then I'll be then we'll go back okay it's 
gotta get this beautiful view. It's a path. Look at this view. Freaking amazing. This is where um, I think the Wisconsin River is right in front of us. And the Mississippi is off to the left over there. And then like over there is Prairie du Chien. And from the sign back there, which I'll film in a minute, but over there is supposed to be Iowa. So pretty hazy again today because it's so hot. And this is a really, really pretty park, but it's really, really hilly. Yep, but it's pretty cool. So yeah, so here's a picture and then it's exactly what you're looking at. So it shows everything, it's pretty cool. They number everything. Um, four is, that, that's pretty easy to cite that, that um, big white thing. Oh, except you can't see it today. Oh man, okay, well I tried. There is this uh, really, really long entrance. Um, you have to drive a really long ways, uh, like miles and miles, to get into the actual entrance to Wild Loosing. Um, and then once you're in there, um, there's like acres between like the campgrounds and the beach and the trailheads. It's really kind of spread out, and I'm sure it's because of its location um, that it's you know between the two rivers you know with Mississippi and the Wisconsin River but it makes for a very interesting park too mm. so the bikes were really helpful to us when we were here so we're taking a ride over to the observatory we're just going to kind of check that out it's about halfway back down to the other um, campground it probably won't go that far into the other campground right now but um, let's see what's this what's happening up here That's the bike trail. Observatory. Still while saying the um, observatory. Look at these little bus well, bathrooms. These little buildings don't know what any of them are for. And that dome. We walked up over there. There's looks like it slides open or something. Maybe they just have Certain days have events or something, I don't know. And this is just a little seating around this building and don't know what that building is, it's all locked up. And there's a little brown building back there too that's all locked up, so. I don't know, it was an easy ride from the Wisconsin Ridge campground though. So um, we're just kinda on a ride today to see other things that we haven't seen at Wild Losing.
This is bumpy. Oh, I didn't expect this. It goes a lot farther, but I'm not going to go on it. That's way too bumpy.